And the National Primary Health Care Development Agency says more human resources, funding and infrastructure will be needed from 2023 to ensure adequate health care to Nigerians. Health correspondent Kemi Balogo reports that this message formed part of discussions at the award presentation ceremony to Nasarawa State for having the highest number of vaccinated citizens in the country through effective leadership. The journey to get 70% of the eligible population vaccinated has been tough with several challenges plaguing the goal. The Apex Vaccination Agency says that more will be needed in the coming years to ensure that the health care of Nigerians is protected through improving primary health care structures. This government has made a lot of progress in terms of uh, primary health care compared to uh, previous governments. But we also know that we're not where we need to be. The fact that we have uh, inadequate numbers of human resources, uh, but we've seen frontline health workers uh, cross rivers, uh, climb mountains just to get uh, vaccines to uh, Nigerians. There's still a lot that needs to be done. But despite all the hurdles, the agency says it has done well with some states leading the pack in getting more citizens vaccinated. States like Nasarawa, Jigawa and Kanu have stood out in both COVID-19 vaccination, improving primary health care structures and immunization numbers, with Nasarawa State having the most numbers. The moment you know exactly I want to be a leader and when I become a leader I want to do A, B, C, D and these are my targets, these are my KPIs, these are how I want to achieve that. I think once you do that and you work towards that, inshallah you will be successful. We've seen uh, that Nigeria is only one of four countries globally where routine immunization actually improved despite uh, setbacks uh, due to the pandemic. So we have our challenges in the primary healthcare space, but it is very clear that we're on the right path. And in the next uh, few months, uh, we'll continue to encourage leaders such as the governor of Nasarawa State, the governors of some of the states I've mentioned, uh, to provide, to continue to uh, provide uh, the, the leadership that is required uh, to bring our communities together, irrespective of our political uh, leanings, irrespective of our ideologies. The one thing that is common is that we need to improve the health of our people. With about 53% fully vaccinated eligible Nigerians, the country is still shy of its 70% expected target by the end of 2022. But the National Primary Healthcare Development Agency says the nation has achieved a lot more than planned, despite the challenges of vaccine hesitancy, lack of human resources and funding. Kemi Balogun, TVC News, Abuja. <laughs>